Hey guys, what's up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, I'm Chloe and I'm at Maple Hospital. I'm just here for a checkup though because like I'm not having the baby yet. Ugh, I really hope I did. I really wish I did though because mm, it's kicking so much. I'm surprised that it's kicking this much for only eight, for only um eight months. Kind of weird. They made me wear the. They made me wear this stupid outfit because they, like, sent it to my house and then said that I have to wear it when I come. It's so annoying. It's so uncomfortable. But, you know, got to do what you got to do. <laughs> of course, I had a night appointment. Okay. Oh. Oh, my God. I think it's... Okay. Never mind. Hi. Hi. Welcome to Maple Hospital. How may I help you? Um, I'm here for my pregnancy checkup. Pregnancy checkup? Okay. Uh-huh. Um, I think you okay. were my nurse for my last, um, check -up. Okay, what's your name? Chloe Hope. Oh, yes, 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 I remember you. Chloe May Hope, and then you do the ebb with an E. Okay. With an E? Uh-huh, an E. Okay. Okay. Um, all right, follow me. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I have a question though, really quick. When I go into birth, am I allowed to have like a curl X or no? Um, um, it doesn't really matter, to be honest. Okay. Here, grab some hand sanitizer now, please. I don't want to, that stuff is musty and crusty. Do I have to? Okay, yes. Fine, or, Fine. there, thanks. I got it. Okay, alright. So, step on here, please. Um, on what, the scale or the height thing? Wait, uh, the weight thing, the scale. Hi, wait. Uh, okay, there we go. I'm 72, okay, not bad, not bad. Oh, I <laughs> went up 70 pounds. Not 70, oh my god, that'd be terrifying. Um, I went up 30 pounds, dang. Okay, um, alright, go to the scale thing for me. Okay, let me just do this, and, okay, so you're five foot. Oh, that's weird, last time I came out was five foot seven. Yeah, I was still in the middle of saying it. Oh, sorry, dang. You're five foot eight. Um, oh. I mean, sorry, five five seven, and then yeah. Okay, thank you. Mhm. Mm yes. Are you gonna um, sit? You have um sass. Well, uh, today's just been a long day for me. Mm, yeah. Sorry, I got a night shift. Not shift. Night appointment. Okay. Oh, ultrasound. Whoops. Whoopsies. I don't like ultrasound. Oh. Anyway. It's okay, though. Okay. So, this is going to be cold. Ooh, okay. I hate cold things, but I'll survive. Ooh, that is cold. Yeah. Okay. And then, there's the baby girl. She's so cute. I have a question. Wait. What? I have a question. Yes? How can you tell if it's a girl or a boy? Oh, doctor things. What type of doctor things? It's hard to explain. Okay. Mm, are you sure? Yeah. It's like, um, let's just go. No, I'd like to know. It's doctor things. I told you. It's doctor tool tools. No, I want to know what, it, what doctor things are. You're an annoying person. 
Um. Wow, thanks. Mm -hmm. Um, anyway. Oh, okay. So, here, let me get this. And you said you're here for a checkup? Yep, I'm only eight months. Oh, okay, eight months, okay. Okay. Because, um, sorry. Here. Dang. Because last time I came, I was, um, seven months. Okay. And then, uh, yeah, I, I think I know what to do, seven plus one, so, eight. Mm -hmm. So, I have a question um, really quickly. Um, do you have any kids? Um, uh, no. Um. Why? Because I just prefer nurses that have kids. I mean, I have a stepdaughter, but... So you don't like kids? No, not that. I have a stepdaughter, but I don't have any kids of my own. Now, why is that? Um, it's because I wasn't, I'm not ready yet, I guess. Totally. Okay. It's going to be fun. Anyway, um, okay, your heart's good and the baby's heart's good. Okay, I kind of care more about the baby than I do myself, so you don't really need to tell me stuff for myself. Okay, that's just called... And then... I'm just... You seem like a very nice lady. I'm so sorry for wasting your time. <clears throat> no, you're not wasting my time. You sure? Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm. All right, let's go upstairs. Here, one second. I have to check my notifications. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's see. Oh, oh this is so cute. Mm-hmm. Um, there we go. Okay. Alright. Oh, this feels so good. Just letting the bump just sit there. <laughs> okay, so how many months did you say you were? I'm eight because last time I came out was seven. Okay. That's just and what then... the doctor told me last time that I would be seven because, yeah. Okay. And then. Hmm. And do you. What's your age? I am 36. Um, and also, by the way, the doctor that I had last time, just like in case you need to know, is Dr. Macy. Oh, Dr. Macy. <laughs> What's wrong with her? She's not, not the best. She's, she gets things really really mixed up and um it, let's just say she doesn't work here anymore since she told um a pregnant lady that she, that um she just she was um pregnant but she wasn't so oh and yeah and also, Dr. Macy, like, she's just bad, to be honest. <laughs> oh, wait. Okay. I'm getting a ton of contractions for being eight months, because when I had my two other children, I did not get these many contractions. Well, three other children. Not, well, I have two, but I gave birth to three. Then where's the third one? Well, let's just say he was at the adoption center. Uh, uh, okay.
by symptoms. Like, I just need to make sure that you're not going into the labor, labor early or anything. Why would I? Well, I have a ton of contractions. The baby's kicking a ton, and that's kind of <clears throat> it. Guess what? All my acrylics fell off besides one. Oh! And you said the baby's kicking a lot? Uh, yes. That's so odd. Um, no, that's what I was saying. I asked Miss mm. Macy about it, and she said that um, it was normal and that it when I was seven months, it was just kicking a little bit, and then she said that that was normal and that it would go away, but it hasn't, and it's gotten worse. Mm. That's weird, because normally when it starts to hurt really bad, you're eight months going into nine months. She told me last time that I was seven. Wait, what'd you say that way, that that she's like a really bad doctor and she got like one person she thought one person was pregnant and she wasn't and then she also got their month their months mixed up and um their contractions were just crazy with dr macy like doing it maybe she got my months mixed up maybe wait when did you get pregnant um, today, this is April, so, April, wait, so, May. Miss? I got pregnant in September, so this is my... Wait, no, I got pregnant in August, because it was August 1st that I found out. Then it's your ninth month. Wait, what? It can't be, though. That's what it's adding. It's adding all up with your contractions. Your sim here, wait, let me record your tractions really quickly. Um, mm -hmm. Here, I'll be right back. I'm going to go get the thing. Okay. I actually am nine months. And she said that Nurse Macy always got stuff wrong, so like, maybe I am nine months. No, but I don't. That means I'd have to have my child soon. I don't know if I'm ready for that pressure, or just in general. Um, I don't, I'm not ready to be a mother. That's why I kind of always want to put Avery up for adoption, but I can't because it's the wrong thing to do. I would if I could. Addie's never around, and I love it, but oh, um, I can't put my child up for adoption again. What? Oh, I didn't, I didn't see you there. Oh, hi. Um, come in, please. Come this way. I'm going to record your contractions just to make sure okay. you're not going into labor yet. What if I am? Wait, am I allowed to put a child up for adoption? What? Okay, um, we did an ultrasound, right? It can't be two kids. Um, well. I mean, the ultrasounds aren't always correct. Um, sometimes they pick up on one child and then the other's like behind the other. And then like the twin is behind the other one. That's like the thing that's picking up, and then the ultrasound thing isn't picking up the other ones. So there's a possibility. Oh, okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Not scare you or anything. Uh huh. Here, just 
set this up. And it's okay. legal to put kids up for adoption, right? What? What? I didn't say anything. I have a question really quick, because my sister, Gracie Hebner, she likes to put her children up for adoption, and she just does it um, so she can write a letter to the storks. <clears throat> And so she does it for that reason, but then she just puts her children up for adoption. So is that legal to put children up for adoption? Um, yeah. Okay, thank you. But, like, you have to wait, like, a day to put the other one up once you actually just, like, put them in, like, like got in labor. Oh. Uh. Mm-hmm. So. And she's pregnant right now, and she's about to give birth, maybe. Um, and she was wondering if you, um, if you have to, um... This isn't your sister, isn't it? It's no, you. No, it is. It's, it's her sister. It's my sister. Okay. And she was just wondering if you have to wait after you give birth or if you can just do it while you're, like, right after. You have to wait at least a day. After labor? Yeah. Okay. Anyway, um, um, yeah, what's up? Mm -hmm. This, um, why does it have two heartbeats on it? Hold on. Wait, why does it have two heart? One of them isn't me, right? Yeah. Yeah, no, because my heart's up there and theirs is down there. Wait, wait. Is that what I think it is? Well, would does it pick up on my heartbeat and the child's heartbeat, or just their heartbeat? Um, just their heartbeat. Why is there two then? Um. Uh, sit up, please. What? Um. Okay. And then here, just let me just put this on you. Um, okay. Um, I'm using the oxygen mask. Okay, there we go. Okay. <gasps> okay, here, let me take this real quick. Wait, why is she so concerned? Dr. Madison! Who's Madison? What is it? Um, you're going to into labor and 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 and. What? What's you're it? having twin girls. One second, you guys. Technical difficulties. I'm so sorry, but we are back. Anyway, but um, you're having twin girls and you're going into labor at the same time. Uh, 
Um, Wait, so yeah. I have. Uh, I. Uh, uh, am I allowed to have a C section? Um. Not this way. Oh! Anyway, um, do you want to, like, give birth now or tomorrow and sleep on it, you know? Which one would you recommend? Um, with your thing right now, I'd say sleep on it. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay, well, I guess I'll see you in the morning, I guess. Sorry, it's such a, like, um, a rush. It, it, it's okay. Good night. Good, good night. And I'm having it. Okay, well, I'm just gonna go to bed. <laughs> Come in. Hello. How are you feeling? Um, worse. Worse? Okay. I threw well, up twice. Well, and that was 20 minutes ago. Uh, okay, do you want the epidural? Of, what type of question is that? Of course I do. Okay, well. Am I, was I allowed to drink water? Because I kind of like chugged a whole bottle. Water is fine. Okay. Um, I'm going to go get the epidural and all the stuff. Okay. You can just sit back and relax. Okay. Oh my god, I'm actually going into labor. Wow, this is going to be so fun. Um, but I was only having one, but now I'm having two, and now it's happening right now. And, oh my god, um, I hate the storks. I'm so putting one up for adoption. Avery's gonna be so thrilled about this. That was that was sarcasm. Oh, uh, I don't know how I'm supposed to tell Avery. She didn't even want a sibling. Now she's getting two. Well, technically, she's only getting one. Wait, I could just put one up for adoption while I'm going back to the house. And then when I'm going back to the house, I could put one up for adoption, and then Avery will only think that I had one, and I never have to tell a soul. Ooh, okay, now I got a plan worked out. Now I'm not so stressed. Mm -hmm. Oh, that one hurt. That one hurt. Where is Nurse Macy? Not Macy. Oh my God, no, no, not Nurse Macy. Where is Nurse Laney? Laney, hello. We start out. Okay, I'm kind of panicking. I'm kind of panicking. Okay, I'm back. Okay, hi. Okay, so all the things. Wait, really quick. Is it okay if we take a rock walk around the hospital really quickly? Um, why? Say yes. Here, um, I'll get a walker. Okay, there we go. Sure. Uh, Is it gonna help? Yes, very much so. Okay. Oh, whoops. So sorry, miss. You kind of need to shave, though. Um... All right, let's go back. I no, think this is really quick, really quick. Just downstairs, okay? I'm not, I'm not, I'm not running out. No, definitely not. Um, I just need a um. Um. Okay. Um. Oh, perfect. Okay. Um. Uh, we, what do you do? Can I just grab um a mask and then we can go back up? There's one right there. Yeah. Let's let's go grab a mask. Okay. Thank you. Okay. What are you doing? What? I grabbed a mask. Go up. All right, let's go. Just yeah. wait. She a runner, she a jack star. She gonna run away, run Get away. Here. No, I don't want to do this. All right, she then you're gonna be in more pain than you are tomorrow. 
fine. I'm going up. Meanie. <gasps> Life is hard. Okay, come this way. <sighs> Never had a patient do this. You're welcome. She ever know she attracts her. She can't ever okay. go anyway. Ow. Okay. Have you ever had a patient as good as me before? Mm -hmm. Yes. What was their name? They, they can't be much better. Thirty minutes later. Boom! Okay, okay, okay. Can we? Can we? Can we please um start? Epidural, please. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, I had to grab something. Please. Okay, here. Sit up. Help. Okay. Oh okay. my God, I can't do this. Now we gotta wait like 10 ish minutes. Oh my god, there's just a needle sticking in my back. No, because I took it out. No, the needle has to stay in my back. Wait, no. No, wait, no. You have to put one on my wrist. No. No, thanks. I don't wanna. No, thanks. No, I don't wanna. <laughs> don't we have to keep that one in? Yeah, the whole time. I hate this. I, I never want to see a child again in my life. What about your own kids? Nope, they're going up for adoption. Oh! That's my way to uh, happiness, the adoption center. Okay. Anyways. Um. Okay. I just let me type this in. Okay. I think it's just a needle. Okay. <laughs> and, okay, are you ready? No. Okay, let's go ahead and start so we can get it over with. I don't want to. Take them to the um area to go clean them. Okay. Oh my god. Avery was even worse than two twins. Maybe because she was so fat. Oh my god, okay. Why was Avery so fat? She's just fat in general. Poor Avery, I feel bad for her. She probably gets bullied. By me. Oh, she's probably flipping me off right now, but that's okay. Come in. Hello. Did somebody just knock or am I going delusional? Hello. Oh. She's gonna be so fun to deal with. Oh my god, her name's Rachel. Oh my god, that's even worse. Rachel! Rachel! Okay, so here's your twin. Congratulations. Oh, look hideous. Yeah, I'm gonna. 
And yeah, here you go. Here's your twins. Let me just lay them right there. Okay. Um, okay. Okay, now which one do I keep? Which one looks cuter? Oh, this one. Okay, I'm keeping this one. Let me just put the other one on the ground. There we go. What do you mean, what am I doing? Why is one of your twins on the edge of the bed? Because it was ugly. Uh, do you want me to put them in the adoption area in this hospital? Yes, can you please? So you don't want this one? Yes, I don't. Okay, goodbye. I'll take this one, this one's cute. Can I just like leave? Well. No, you cannot leave. You gotta go back in. Go back in. Go back in. I'm your doctor now since Dr. Laney had to go. Help me. Anyway, um, let me just check you out again. Don't you just... need to ask questions about me? You guys never did that. No, I, we already did that. So shut up. So what's your baby's name gonna be? Um, Brianna. B R A I N A. No, N N A. Okay. So two N's or one N? Uh, you decide. No, because I'm not allowed to do that. One or two N's? Choose a number, one or two. Oh my gosh, child. Just do fine, one. Thank you. Here you go, Brianna Hope. Uh huh. Brianna Lynn Hope. Brianna Lynn Hope. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you have like mental issues? No. Why? Because your voice. Why? Okay, here's your thing, and you can leave now. Bye. The thing. God, was so annoying. Okay. Well, this is going to be it for today's video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you get notified whenever I post new videos. Bye, you guys.